Glad you're here. Blue and I were just about to. Hello. It's a bug. Actually, I'm <clears throat> a treasure bug. A treasure bug? A treasure bug. Are you ready for the big treasure hunt? Did this bug, I mean, treasure, bug, say treasure hunt? Yep, you bet. And no treasure hunt is complete without. Ta-da! A treasure map! Oh! A treasure map! This is so great! Look at that! You'll find the treasure if you listen to me. Look for scrolls. I've hidden three. Follow the last scroll till you find the X. There you'll find me and my treasure chest. Then if you tell me one special friend's favorite treasure, the one that is her greatest pleasure, I will give you the first of three keys. To get into the land of great discovery. Go on all three hunts and get three keys. Then you can go into the land of great discovery. Yeah, Blue, a treasure hunt that will take us to the land of great discovery. Boo, boo. Hey, well, how will we know whose favorite treasure we're looking for, Treasure Bug? Precisely why I am here, my friend. First, you must discover Paprika's favorite treasure, for it is, you see, her greatest pleasure. Paprika's favorite treasure, huh? I think we can do that. Hey! Where are you going? To hide with the treasure chest. Oh, oh. So, we have to find three scrolls. We have to find Treasure Bug's hiding place. And we have to discover Paprika's favorite treasure. That's a lot. Will you help? You will? Great. So, how are we going to figure out Paprika's favorite treasure? You know, Blue? Oh, I get it. We'll play Blue Clues to 
to figure it out. Will you help? You will? Great. What's your choice? Just click on it. A sparkly cloth. Perfect. There. So clean, it, uh, sparkles. Okay, now that we cleaned up that paw print, we need our handy dandy... Notebook! Notebook. Right. Now, where did I put that notebook anyway? You're looking for this, Steve? I sure am. Whoa! Thanks, side table drawer. You're welcome, Steve. You know, I can tell I'm really going to need your help today trying to figure out what Paprika's favorite treasure is. Will you help? Great. Now, some play blue clues we got. What's your choice? Just click on it. Paw prints. Three paw prints. Yeah, that's it. Because paw prints are our... Clues. Clues. Yeah. And each time we find one, we put it in our... Notebook. Notebook. Right. And when we find our last clue, we go to our... Uh, where do we go? Let's put our first sticker in the first spot. Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. Now, let's read our treasure hunt scroll. Here's the treasure hunt hint. You'll find our next scroll with someone who has spots of dark pink and even a tail that wags, I think. All right, cool. I wonder who that could be. Treasure bug saying he's arriving here today for treasure hunt. Wow! Hey, but he's already here. Guess the mail was a little slow this week. <laughs> hey, Blue, we're off to school. We could find some for you while we're out and about. Oh, goody! Here, you can use this basket. Oh. I need four leaves, and each of them should be a different color, okay? Oh. Oh. a very colorful fall without fall leaves. I love the season and you can have a very colorful fall. Ooh, I can't wait to put the fall leaves on my tree.
triangle. A yellow circle. I made a sailboat under the sunny sun. A red square. Green triangle. A small yellow rectangle. I made a house. Look how tall I'm getting. Do you know how tall you are? <laughs> Did you get me my four leaves? Off to the park. Let's jog. Love those falling leaves. Hmm. Green Kitten said she needed four leaves, and each of them should be a different color. Ready to catch them in the basket, Blue? Cool. You got it. Nice catch. Hey, hey, we did it. Hey, I know, Blue. Why don't you put those leaves for Green Kitten in a safe place, and you can catch some more if you want. Now, how about getting two red leaves, three yellow leaves. Nice catch! All leaves caught and accounted for. How about catching, um, let me think, four?
four orange leaves, two red leaves. Hey, Blue, I know someone who's going to be really happy with her leaves. Green kitten. Yeah, come on. colors and they're so pretty. Now I can finish decorating. On the book. The book. Wow, that is great. Now we need our handy dandy. You are so right. Hey, you'll help me draw this blue, right? Cool. Okay. So will you help me draw this clue by using the shapes? Cool. That's where that shape. Cool. Yeah. Those shapes go together to make the clue. This book has a rectangle shape for the cover, and another long skinny rectangle for the edge, and some straight lines to show the back cover and the pages. That was our first clue. Okay, so a book is part of Paprika's favorite treasure. I wonder what her treasure could be. Any ideas? I guess we need to find two more clues. treasure bug. Yeah, he said you were on a treasure hunt. He was hiding in the... Don't say it, Shovel. We don't want to give away the secret. No way.
Putting on treasure hunts for my friends is my great treasure. so smart. The treasure hunt scroll leads to magenta. Now where does that sticker go? Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. Thanks, Blue. Let's read our next scroll. Okay, treasure hunters, here's the hint. Search for someone soft and brown. She is the furriest one around. Hmm. Okay, we'll keep that in mind as we continue on our treasure hunt. Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. You did it! That's so cool! Now let's look at our treasure map. Okay, let's put the baby bear sticker where it belongs. Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. I wonder where we'll find our next scroll. Hey, Steve and Blue! Treasure Bug wanted me to give you something. I hope it's too wet. Oh, that's okay, baby bear. We really need it. And sheesh, what's the water anyway? Ooh. Thanks, Blue. Will you read it with me? Great. Here goes. Our third hint. Come look for the X in a place where Blue plays along with her friends on bright, sunny days. Whoa, an X. Mark's butt. I bet I know what's hiding there. <laughs> you found me. Now if you know Paprika's favorite treasure, the one that is her greatest pleasure, I will give you the first key to the land of great discovery. Oh, we haven't found out yet. We have to keep playing new school to figure it out. We're working on it. Okie dokie.
What's in my piggy bank, Blue? What? Two blue dollars. We better hold on to this. I made a rhyme. Want to hear it? Lickety tickety clock. That's me. And I'm a clock. My hands go round. And this is sound. Tickety tickety talk. boat. I just love to row my boat and pop bubbles in the bath. If anybody asked me what my favorite treasure was, I'd say bubbles. What? See a clue? Where? Over there! Oh, there's a clue on Paprika's peanut shell bed. Now what do we do? Right, we need a handy dandy. No. Will you help me draw this clue? Thanks. We're ready to draw this clue. Can you help me? You can draw it by using these shapes. shapes go together to make the clue. Paprika's peanut shell bed has a big curvy line here and another curvy line here. Some more curvy lines for the blanket, like so, and finally some little marks to finish the shell.
Hey, that was our second clue. Okay, so we have a peanut shell bed and a book. What could Paprika's favorite treasure be that has a bed and a book? I wonder. Ooh, guess we need to find another clue. Did you see that? Blue just skidooed right into that poster. Come on, let's go. Blue skidooed, we can too. Wow! Check it out! We're in the Kitchen Art Museum. I always wanted to come here. This is gonna be good. And welcome to the Kitchen Art Museum. like this picture got all mixed up. I hope you can help me put it back the way it's supposed to be. Oh, boo. It's looking better. That looks so much better. Now I can even tell what it is. <laughs> and it's my kind of art. Thank you. On the moon. Wow. You know what this means. We need our handy dandy notebook. Will you help me draw this clue? Okay. I'll need your help drawing this clue. You can do it by using three of these shapes. Cool. Yeah. Those shapes go together to make the clue. The moon starts with a big curve that's like part of a circle, then a smaller curve that goes back to the start. There! A moon! Hey, that's our third clue. A peanut shell bed, a book, and the moon. We have all three clues! Do you know what this means? We're ready to sit in our... thinking chair. Let's go. Okay, now that we're in our thinking chair, let's sit. So, we're trying to figure out what Paprika's favorite treasure is. And our clues are... Her peanut shell bed. The storybook. And the moon. Well, what could Paprika's favorite treasure be that has to do with... Her bed, a book, and the moon? Do you know? Paprika's favorite treasure is a book about the moon. Well, there's a book and a moon, but I don't see her bed. Maybe her favorite treasure is something else. Um. Paprika's favorite treasure is sleeping in her bed on the moon. That's pretty silly. And I don't see a book anywhere. Do you? Hmm. Her favorite treasure is probably something else. Yeah. Um. That's it. Paprika's favorite treasure is being in bed with a book at night. It's a bedtime story. Hey, that's great. We just figured out Blue's Clues. 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 Blue's clues because we're really smart. Right, Blue. Let's go find Paprika and tell her we figured it out. Come on. Rika, we figured out what your favorite treasure is. 
Yep, it's a bedtime story. It is indeed, Steve. You are so smart. Well, you know, I, I had some help. I was just going to read Paprika a story. Would you like to help? It would be such a treat. Yeah, sure. Oh, boy! Paprika just loves her bedtime stories. Would you like to help make some to tell her? Yes! And if you want to hear one of the stories, just click on us. Right, Mrs. Pepper? Right, Mr. Salt. Oh, and if you want to change the story, just click on the little pictures. Then you can pick another picture and voila! Paprika will have a new story to hear. Now we can tell Treasure Bug that we know Paprika's favorite treasure. Uh, where is Treasure Bug? Do you remember? The school playground. Oh, this is so great. Now if you know Paprika's favorite treasure, the one that is her greatest pleasure, I will give you the first key to the land of great discovery. We know what her favorite treasure is, Treasure Bug. Paprika's favorite treasure is a bedtime story. All right.
Then we have something to you from me. It is a very special key. The first one to the land of great discovery. It's a book. I didn't realize that a book was a key. Well, let's go try it in our bookcase. Okay, here we are. Now what do we do? The book. The book? What should we do with the book? Put it away. Oh, put it away. Good idea. So, where do you think it'll fit? The book was a key. A key to the secret passageway to the land of great discovery. Let's go. It's locked. We must need another key. Oh, yeah. We'll play another treasure hunt with Treasure Bug. Then we'll get another key. Okay, let's start the next treasure hunt. Yeah. Hi, it's yours truly again. Mailbox. Are you ready to play the next treasure hunt? Or you can start the old one over again if you want. Do you know how happy I am that you're back? So happy. Blue. They're back. <laughs> what should we do? I'm here. You're here. Blue's here. We could, uh... I have... It's the treasure box. We're so glad you're here! Is it time for another treasure hunt? It's time to hunt for scrolls! And when you find me, I'll have the second key to unlock a discovery. Whoa. It's another treasure hunt! What do we have to find? Do you know? Three cookies. Maybe. Yes. Three scrolls. Three scrolls. Of course. That's correct. But to get the key, you must tell me. Mailbox's favorite treasure, for it is, you see, his greatest pleasure. Farewell, my friends. Oh, wait. Mr. Bug? We... Where did he go? Oh, right. He's hiding the treasure chest. So, we have to find three scrolls, discover Treasure Bug's hiding place, and find out Mailbox's favorite treasure. Whoa, that's a lot. You know, I'm really going to need your help on this. So, how will we find out Mailbox's favorite treasure? Oh, I get it. We'll play Blue Blues to figure it out. Will you help? You will? Great. We are gonna play Blue's Clues, cause it's a really great game. Yeah. So remember, Blue's paw print will be on the clues. Blue's Clues. So, uh, now what should we do? Clean off the paw print. Clean off the paw print. Good thinking. But how should we do it? Ooh, look. Hey, we could use one of these things, but which one? What's your choice? Just click on it. Hey, what's this doing down there? <laughs> okay, this is great. Now all we need is our handy dandy... No! Nope. Still got it, right here. So, now we can figure out what Mailbox's favorite treasure is. All we have to do is find three, um, what do we have to find three of? Paw prints. Paw prints, right, because those are the clues, Blue's clues. So, what are we waiting for? I don't know. Uh, no, side table drawer. We already have our notebook.
No, I know you have the notebook. It's something else. Something else? What else could she have? <laughs> Ooh! It's a scroll! Our first scroll for our treasure hunt. Thanks, I table drawer. Hey, now, let's look at our treasure map. Let's start our new treasure hunt by putting our side table drawer sticker where it belongs. Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. Okay, let's read our treasure hunt scroll. Here's the treasure hunt hint. The next scroll is with someone who likes bubbles and he likes to be clean. And soon, I think, you'll see what I mean. Cool. We're on the case. Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. One of the things I treasure most in this room is the thinking chair. Yeah, because that's where I do most of my best thinking. This is so exciting! Just to think that the land of great discovery is right behind that door. Yes, that's where the scroll leads. Wow, are you smart or what? Now we can stick down the slippery sticker on our map. Oh, oh. Just click on the yellow arrow. Oh, Steve, Blue, I think I have something for you. Whoa, whoa. Here you go. Yes, thank you, Slippery. Ooh. Thanks, Blue. Will you read it with me? Great. Now hunt for orange stripes and a very long tail. I know you can do it. I know you won't fail. Hey. We're writing letters to our friends. Yeah, and making pictures. But we have a problem. We have our pictures. And we have our letters and the envelopes and addresses. But we're forgetting something. I just know. Will you help us find what we need? Oh! Thanks, Blue. Hope you come back and help us soon. Thanks a bunch. We're writing Hope you... Finally getting around to putting my stamp collection together. Oh, hey, is that your favorite treasure? Because you know we're out on this big treasure hunt looking for your favorite treasure. My stamp collection is a treasure, all right. But not my favorite treasure. Oh. Well, what is your favorite treasure? I have an idea or two. But you're gonna have to... Figure it out. Knock, knock. Who's there? Knock, 
confused. I can't find my bear the trigger. <laughs>
Hello, Blue. Hello, Blue. Blue, Blue. Lucky you are to be on a treasure hunt. My most treasure. We're writing letters to our friends. Yeah, and making pictures. But we have a problem. We have our pictures. And we have our letters and the envelopes and addresses. But we're forgetting something. I just know it. Will you help us find what we need? Oh! Thanks, Blue. Hope you come back and help us soon. Thanks a bunch! Oh look, postage stamps. Those? They're extras. I already have some like that. Do you want them? Thanks. You know, these might come in handy. Stamps! That's what we needed. Yeah! Thanks, Steve. Thanks, Blue. <laughs> But now we have another problem. See? Everything's ready to mail. But our letters and pictures got all mixed up. Yeah. We don't know which picture goes with which letter. Can you help us? Oh, oh. Great. Okay. Listen to this letter. Dear Paprika, what do you like to drink before you go to bed? See if you can match my picture up to Pale's letter, okay? When I show the pictures to you, click on the one you think is right, okay? Bow, bow. Okay. Okay, now listen to this. Dear Magenta, guess what? We are learning how to tell time. See if you can pick the picture that goes with that letter. That... There! Here's another letter. Dear Purple Kangaroo, know what we like to paint? Pictures of things we see at the beach. Okay. See if you can pick the picture. Hmm, I'm not sure that's the one we're looking for. I have an idea. I'll read the letter again. Dear Purple Cat. Ready to go. Ooh, listen to this one. Mr. Paul and Mrs. Pepper. We heard that Paprika loves to listen to stories. So which one of my pictures goes with Pale's letter? G. Listen to this one, okay? Dear Steve, for your birthday, Mr. Salt and Mrs. Pepper are going to bake you a surprise. Get ready to pick the right picture. Listen to this one. For Mr. Alt and Mrs. Pepper, 
In our garden, we want to grow food that is yellow, sweet, and crunchy. Okay, which one of these goes with Pale's letter? that goes with Pale's letter. Ready to go! So, listen to this one, okay? Dear Slippery, let's go to an island. How will we get there? Now which picture goes with Pale's letter? <laughs> there! Here's another letter. Treasure bug. Sometimes we'd like to go on a treasure hunt too. Hmm. Do you know which picture goes with that letter? What's your favorite place? We think we know. Now which picture goes with the letter? Another letter. Dear Purple Kangaroo, do you know the rhyme, Hey Diddle Diddle? Who ran away at the end of the rhyme? Okay, get ready to pick the picture that goes with Pale's letter. Got it. So, listen to this one, okay? Here's something you like that rolls and bounces. Okay, which one of these goes with Pale's letter? My pictures goes with Pale's letter. Thanks a double lot. Thanks a bunch. A clue, a clue. You see a clue? Where? Over there. Oh, on this mail. So, mail must be part of Mailbox's favorite treasure. You know what we need? Our handy-dandy notebook. Right. You'll help me draw this, right? Okay. Okay. So, will you help me draw this clue by using the shapes? Which three of these shapes make up our clue? Cool. That's cool. Look at that. Those shapes make our clue. The top letter is a rectangle. Little drawings show who it's from and who it's to. The stamp is a little square shape. Now add some straight lines back in here. Great, a stack of mail. That was our first clue. Okay, so 
No big surprise, mail is a part of Mailbox's favorite treasure. I wonder what the treasure could be. Any ideas? I think we need to find two more clues. Hello, hello. Can you help me? I'm lost. You're lost. Of course we can help you. Where do you belong? With my other bird friends. Hey, why don't you come with us until we find your friends? Okay, thanks. Yep, that's for me. Yes, cool. We did it. Now we can stick down an orange kitten sticker. Just click on the yellow arrow when you that's where our next sticker will go. You know what? Somebody left something here for you. Thanks, Blue. Let's read our next scroll. Are you ready? Yeah, we're getting so close. Okay, here goes. Ready? Okay. Come and find me if you can. Just look for the X right in the sand. Whoa! Did you hear that, Treasure Hunters? Do you know where that X is? Okay, let's go hunt for Treasure Bug. Just click on the yellow arrow when you're ready to leave. That says school. Zippity A, I'm back. Thanks. Okay, buddies, hit it. I love that song. A clue, a clue. You see a clue? Where? are so right. There it is, on this music. You know what we need? Our handy dandy notebook. Oh, and I also need your help to draw this clue, okay? We're ready to draw this clue. Can you help me? You can draw it by using just three of these shapes. Yep. Cool. That looks like the clue to me. To show music, we start with a straight line, add a circle shape, and a little flag shape. Draw a couple more straight lines, more circle shapes. Now, connect these notes with two straight lines. There, it's music. Hey, that was our second clue. It looks like mail and music are two parts of Mailbox's favorite treasure. I wonder what it could be. Guess we need that last clue. Looks like Blue just skadooed into that nursery rhyme book. Well, what are we waiting for? Skidoo, we can too. <coughs> nursery rhyme land is one of my favorite places. <coughs> Blue's too.
Can you help? Can we help? Miss Muffet, of course we can help. I'm Steve and this is Blue, and she is a big fan of yours. You know me? Oh, oh good, because I've been saying my rhyme over and over. And I just can't remember the last part. See? Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and wet. <laughs> Along came a... That's the part that I can't figure out. I can't remember who came along. Hmm. What could it be? Who came along next to Little Miss Muffet? Could it be one of these, Miss Muffet? I think so. Will you help? Who is it that comes along in Little Miss Muffet's story? A spider. It's along came a spider who sat down beside her. A spider? Yes, now I remember. And frighten Miss Muffet away. Ah, that's it. It was a spider. She's right. Wow, she hardly touched her curds and whey. Well, all in a day's work. I'm sorry, I, I can't hear you. Up there, on the clock. You were right. How great is that? <laughs> you know what we need now? Our handy dandy? Notebook. Right. You know, I could use a little help drawing this clue. I'll need your help drawing this clue. You can do it by using three of these shapes. Cool. That's what... Yeah. Those shapes go together to make the clue. Start with two circles. 
add two straight arrows for the hands, here and here, this is where the numbers go. 1 to 12. Okay, it's a clock that tells time. Hey, that's our third clue. Mail, a clock that tells time, and music. We have all three clues. Do you know what this means? We're ready to sit in our thinking chair. Let's go. Okay, now that we're in our thinking chair, let's think. Oh, we're trying to figure out what Mailbox's favorite treasure is. And our clues are... A clock that tells time. And... Music. So, what could Mailbox's favorite treasure be with mail, a clock that tells time, and music? What do you think? Mailbox's favorite treasure is a cuckoo clock. No, hold it. A cuckoo clock does tell time and it sings a song, but I don't see any mail. Do you? Maybe his favorite treasure is something else. <coughs> Mailbox's favorite treasure is to play a horn? Yeah, that's it. No, no, wait a minute. A horn does play music, but what about the time part and the mail? It must be something else. Hey, you got it. Mail, a clock that tells time, and musical notes from a song. Mailbox's favorite treasure is the Mail Time song. Hey, that's great. We just figured out Blue's Clues. 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 Because we're really smart. Right, Blue? Now let's go tell Mailbox we figured out his favorite treasure. Come on. Hey, Mailbox. We figured out your favorite treasure. Well then, let me have it. It's the Mail Time song. It certainly is. I have many treasures, but the mail song is definitely my favorite. And I've got something for you, too. For us? Oh, thanks, Mailbox. Hey, Blue, isn't this great? Now we can play the mail time song for Mailbox. Oh, look at that, my friend. My greatest and most favorite treasure is already in the cassette player. Can you do me a favor and play it for me, please? Just click on the green button, okay? Oranges grow on Here it is, my most favorite. Just click on the app. The we just figured out. Just click on the app. Blue's Clue. Blue's Big Treasure Song. The Salong Song. The Planet Song. Blue's Birthday Song. Up a mountain. Healthy snack. Thanks for playing. See ya. Oh, you're back. Great. Music, maestro. <laughs> oh, this is great. You can learn how to play some of our favorite Blue's Clues songs. And here it's Healthy Snack. Oops. 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 Yeah, that's it. What a song, huh? Now, if you want to hear the song you just learned to play, click on the button of Blue's ears.
The we just figured out blues. Just click on the arrows. The we just figured out blues clues song. Okay, let's play. Oops. Oh, great playing, great song! Here it is, just click on the up mail time! And Hey, you did it! What a musician! Oranges grow on trees! Oranges grow on trees! Okay, let's play! That was fantabulous! You did a great job playing that song! Get it! What a musician! Hear what you learned to play! Blue's big treasure song! Here goes! Bust along song! And here it comes! Bust along song! Yeah, that's it. What a song, huh? Blue's big... Blue's big treasure song. Yeah.
Wow, great playing, great song. Hear what you learned to play. The planet song. The planet song. Here we go. That was fantabulous! You did a great job playing that song! Blow's birthday! Blow's birthday song! And a one, and a two, and a... Oops! Hey, you did it! What a musician! Up a mountain! Up a mountain! Here goes! Yeah, that's it. What a song, huh? Hear what you learned to play. Thanks for playing. See ya. An X. An X marks the spot. I bet I know what's hiding there. Now if you know Mailbox's favorite treasure, the one that is his greatest pleasure, I will give you the second key to the land of great discovery. We know what his favorite treasure is. Mailbox's favorite treasure is the Mail Time Song. Of course it is. Then I have something to you from me. It is a very special key. The second one to the land of great discovery. A xylophone? That's a funny key. I guess you never know what to expect with Treasure Bug. Let's go see how this key works. Okay, now it's time to use this key. This xylophone key. Maybe we should play this xylophone the same way the door just played it. What a great idea. Hmm. Listen to this. Now, I wonder what's going to happen. Wow! Look at that! There it is. The land of great discovery! We're almost there! 
but it's really far away. Hey, maybe we need another key to get there. Looks like we better finish the big treasure hunt. Yeah. Mailbox here again. Do you want to play a new treasure hunt? Are you ready to put in disc two now?